What is up, ladies and gentlemen? It is your boy A. That's Aaron, and yo, I truly did not expect to make this video, bro. I just woke up for work literally like 30 40 minutes ago, and we already got hit with a bunch of information with my boy Tengen. And we got the video, we got we got his moves, we got what the new Russia looks like, everything. We got everything regarding Tengen and our release dates, ladies and gentlemen. It's about to be crazy. So, we're gonna hop into the video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I promise I'm gonna keep it short and sweet. I'm not gonna BS y'all for like 10, 10, 15 minutes, okay? Because I, I still gotta go to work, okay? Okay. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen. Um, so, the other day, the voice actor, the J Japanese voice actor for Tengen, was able to play with Tengen in Demon Slayer The Hinokami Chronicles as, like, you know, a little gameplay test run or whatever, right? And we get our first look at the roster. The new roster, they switch things around, obviously, because they're adding in. Uh, what is it like? Um, I don't know if it's technically four. Okay, so let's let's look at it. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven characters. But like I said in my previous videos, we don't know if the academy, not the academy, if the entertainment arc district characters are really going to be real DLC or are they just going to be reskins. And more than likely, I'm starting to get the reskin vibes, but I don't know. But anywho, we got my boy Tengen in the trailer. Not the trailer, in the roster just looking so clean. Ah, I love it. And then he goes into doing some combos in the um, actual gameplay of the match. So let's get to that gameplay part. So basically, in the gameplay part, we're finally able to see all of Tengen's moves. If you play Demon Slayer Hino Coming Chronicles, typically characters have three moves you have your special button your side special button and then your guard skill right so typically your side special is more of a lunging kind of thing anyways so let me put you like this okay so the y button is whenever he swings around not the y button the ability button is whenever he swings around his swords and he has his bombs which leads into that stun animation which allows you to get more of a combo in so that's going to really help extend your combos and i'm pretty sure that the left his side skill button is whenever he dashes forward, you dashes forward with the bombs, it does not lead into a stun animation. So you're probably just gonna have to link that up with something else. You know what I'm saying? So that that's perfectly fine because they all look like they link together. And then finally, we have his guard skill, and his guard skill is basically gonna be his DP, where he's gonna be able to use with invincibility frames and not have to worry about getting hit with anything crazy. And his guard skill is where he kicks you up in the air. And it looks like you can be able to combo after that. And typically, characters will have a, uh, a lot of characters' guard skills are kind of like that. The first two that comes, to, the first one that comes to mind is Makomo, because Makomo does that. Um, that's her guard skill. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anyone else. I know there there gotta be other characters, but typically their DPS are always their guard skills. Whenever you hold the guard button, the ability. So yeah, that's that's gonna be clean. Um, then they show us the ultimate, what it looks like. You know what I'm saying? Full animation at all. This shows what he looks like in his boost slash surge mode. That junk also looks clean. And so, yeah. And if and I'm going to put the gameplay up in the corner. Uh, I'm going to put the gameplay during the video, but I'm not going to have it during the whole video because I'm not trying to get my count knocked off. You know what I'm saying? Um, but, yeah, we got the gameplay and everything, and we finally have an official release date. He is dropping today, ladies and gentlemen. Ting is dropping today. Like, it, uh, he's dropping um july 14th in japan and typically that that equals up to 8 p.m eastern standard time and 2 a.m um central time right so if you live on the west coast that's a four hour difference he's gonna be coming out to y'all at like 12 yeah you know he's gonna come out to 12 come out for y'all at 12 but for people on the east coast he'll drop at eight which is understandable because typically all the other dlcs did drop around eight o'clock so yeah also um you know as you guys can see on the roster we are getting nezuko in her demon form and she is going to be an actual demon it's going to be by herself so that's going to be pretty cool and yeah man so um yeah man i'm, I'm excited i'm happy i gotta take my ass to work but yeah let me let me know what y'all think in the comment section man are y'all happy with what, what we're getting are y'all excited just let me know man and um yo there's a video dropping later today and i'll see y'all next time peace out